it's great to be back at Trade Tech this year. It's great to be back working for Quant House uh, this year as I've recently rejoined the company, having worked there previously. Um, one of the things that I'm really looking forward to with working Quant House is the way that we very much put our customers first. Um, our client base is very, very important to us. The feedback that I've had from our clients already since I've been here, since I've been back here, which is just a month, is they love working with our data. Some of the customers that were clients of ours back in 2009 and 2011, it was great to see they're still clients with us today, which says an awful lot about the resilience and the reliability of our market data products. We very much put our clients first and we want to build bespoke data and connectivity packages based on their requirements and the agileness of Quant House allows us to do that. Having come back to Quant House a second time, my role is currently a mere head of sales for Quant House, Quant House being a part of Iris. So I'm very much focused on expanding our footprint in EMEA and also looking after our current customer base as well. And one other thing I'd like to say is one of the reasons for coming back to work for Quant House, I'm very, very pleased to see clients that were with us before, but also to see what Iris are doing from an investment point of view. So Iris have invested in our infrastructure. So from a redundancy perspective and resiliency perspective, we've made it an even better service for our existing customer base. We have double the budget that we had last year to develop more and more feed handlers for our customers and for our new customer base as well. So what's coming down the track? Uh, people may have seen a recent press release that we did in partnership with BMLL where we're uh, symbology mapping between the BMLL data set and the Quant House market data set to make it more quicker and efficient for our clients to move from back testing into production. That's one thing. Another thing, we have a delay and replay service from a targeting of clients perspective. This is something that's potentially very good from a regulatory perspective. Clients can replay back the, the market intraday. So from a market abuse perspective or a trade surveillance perspective, this is a really useful tool to allow them to be able to do that.